Welcome to this review of the U8 motion detection spy camera. I'm going to hold it in my hand to give you an idea of the size, so it is quite small and can be concealed. Now, before you use the camera, you need to charge it. So you pull off the cap, there you have the USB, and you just plug that right into the computer. Now, you're going to see right over here, it's going to flash blue. You're going to see a blue light flashing. This is the LED light indicator. Now, when the light stops flashing, it's fully charged. Now, once it's charged, What you need to do is you have to insert the memory card. Now I already have it inside, so to remove it you just push it in like that and it comes right out. You'll feel it click, that's when it comes out. And to insert it, just put it in right there. And you're gonna feel it click once and now it's inserted properly. Okay. Now, the first thing you need to do is turn the camera on. Now this is the K1 button. You have to hold this down and you're going to feel it vibrate. and it's gonna and the light here will turn a steady red that means it's in standby so let's do that just heard the vibration and there's the steady red it's now in standby now to record a video you have to hold down the K2 button it's gonna vibrate twice and it's gonna record video after the red light flashes three times. So the K2 button is right here. So you have to hold it down. There's the two vibrations. Let it go. And it's now recording. Now the lens is right there. That's the lens. I'll give you a close-up. On it. It's a very, very small lens. Right next to it, you can see a little hole over there. That's the microphone. So it's recording right now. Now, to stop recording, you just press the K2 and it's going to return to standby. So let's do that. And there you go. It's back to standby with a steady red light. Now, to take photos, you press the K2 and just press it. Don't hold it down, press it and it's going to vibrate. So I'm going to do that now. So as you just saw there, you just took a photo. Now to take more photos, just repeat the process. Just push it again. See it? The blue light, red again. Blue light, red again. Blue light, red again. So we just took a few photos. And now it's back into standby mode. So you can continue using the camera's features. Now to activate motion detection, while the camera's in standby mode, as it is now, you can see the steady red light right there. You press the K3 button, which is right here, and it's going to vibrate three times, and the blue light is going to flash four times, and then go off. So I'm going to do it now. I'm going to press the K3, so there you go, three vibrations and the four blue light flashes, and now it's recording video. 
To activate the motion detection, press the K1 button, and the blue light is going to flash six times, and you are now in motion detection mode. So I'm going to do that right now. And there you go. The camera is in motion detection mode. Now what's going to happen is, when the camera detects motion, the blue light is going to flash once, go off, and that is how the motion detection is activated. And it's going to film for about two minutes, and during this time, if there's no more motion, the camera will go off. And as soon as it detects motion again, it's going to go on again and stop again at around two minutes. Now to turn the motion detection off, just press the K3 button, and now it's back in standby mode. And to turn the camera off, just press and hold the K1 button, and the camera is now off. Okay, so I'm going to take some footage with the camera, and I'm going to show you how it turned out. So please stay tuned. Okay, so I'm going to be taking some test footage with the U8 motion detection spy camera. I'm going to be testing the video as well as the audio.
Uh, well, I'm not noticing it, so I'm actually holding it in my hand. Okay, so that was the test footage that I just took with the camera. I did do a couple of reviews of other spy cameras. I put some links in the video description and you can take a look at those. So I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please show your support for this channel by subscribing. Feel free to leave comments. Please like up the video and thank you for tuning in.